Today I want to talk to you about hybridization of coconut palms. We have, as you can see, a short palm, the dwarf. When crossed with a tall palm, uh, you get very, very good hybrids. The father is noted through research done earlier to be a very good parent whose good characteristics are transmitted to the progeny, that means the hybrid, and therefore a special mother having a special symbiosis with the father produces this very special hybrid, which is high yielding, good size of coconut, yielding early, having all the characteristics that make for better commercial value for the farmer. And that's our Sampurna. The DJ Sampurna is the highest yielding coconut palm we believe in the world. We'll show this to you in stages. The emasculation stage, where a spade, which is the flower before it opens, is opened manually. Every male flower is removed. Now this process takes 15 minutes to remove over 10,000 male flowers. We mark on the leaf the date of emasculation and then the technician who is expert and trained in this and doing it for a long time, he comes along checking this plant regularly over the next three weeks, waiting for these female buttons, we call them, to get ready, to get mature. Uh, there's a little drop of nectar on the tip of it, which tells him it's ready for pollination. So we have collected the pollen, processed the pollen from the tall trees, processed that in the lab, stored it, and then given it out in vials so that the technician then take the pollen of the chosen variety of tall palm and pollinate the female buttons on this tree. Pollination is done by a brush. The brush tip touches the pollen and puts it onto the tip of the little uh, mature button and the count is taken. 120 days later, we check how many buttons are left. Around 20% are left on the tree. And out of these, around 90% will grow into mature coconuts, which will be our hybrid seed nut, which then goes into the nursery. The nursery man is an expert. He just has to shake that coconut uh, to know whether the right amount of water is in the coconut. And at the right stage, he will send it to the nursery beds for planting. A month later, germination starts. You see the little sprouts coming out. Within six months, the plants are nice and about two and a half feet tall when they are sold to customers.